everyone welcome back to my channel i hope everybody's having a great day today today i'm going to share my dollar tree haul with you guys a lot of it consists of little um stocking stuffers not that i didn't have enough but i got bigger socks for my boys for my grandson so i had to get a few more things to fill it so uh let's get right into that and at the end i have two things i want to share with you guys just some project shares so um i'm just going in any order okay guys so i picked up these are my favorite go-to's whenever i'm on my way to work and i'm running late i don't get a chance to eat i grab one of these and i love them so this is just the cinnamon and brown sugar breakfast little biscuits you get five packs in here with two per pack these are really really good i picked up the uh brown sugar and cinnamon and i also picked up the blueberry i love them both very very much they're really really good so i got those i also picked these up for stocking stuffers for my littles they love these so um i'm going to divide them amongst the three boys and it is just the um bear paws this is a rainbow chip and this one is just the sandwich cookie they will love it i'll put a couple in each of their little socks so they will love to have little treats like that pick this up for myself it's a lemon iced tea country time zero calories and i just picked that up to have on hand i love iced tea i do I got this for little baby river sock and it's just a ball. He loves any kind of ball at this stage in his life. So I just picked him up one of those to have. I got these for Phoenix and Lincoln. They love to, they have a craft room or a room, I should say downstairs in their uh, beautiful, beautiful uh, rec room. But off to the side, they, my daughter made it into like a room where they can go and do arts and crafts or they can do their schoolwork or stuff like that. So I just picked up two of these and they could put those on their shelf and it's just the dough, modeling dough. So just like Play-Doh, I guess, but the Dollar Tree's version. So I picked up two of those and at the top they have little cutout shapes for them. So they'll like that. Um, what else did I get for their sock? Oh, I got this for little baby River, just a little sippy cup or spill proof cup. And they're training him to get off of his bottle now. So um, I got him one of those. Um, what else did I get? Oh, I got this for the littles, for my little grandson. So it's just the Aura Gel Training Toothpaste, fluoride free. So I got this for Little River and I picked one up for Lincoln as well. So it's just the little toothbrush, two in the pack Colgate toothbrushes. And this is that little, oh, Ryan's World. So they'll like that. And, and I got that for um, River and then I picked up so I just got this one for River. Sorry, I thought I got that one for Lincoln as well. Lincoln, that's true. Lincoln has the kids crest with the same one, the Ryan's World little toothbrushes, as well as Phoenix got that as well. So he got the kids um, crest cavity protection and the little toothbrushes for him. So the boys all have that. I also got them these adorable little wallets. I don't know if Phoenix will like his, but you know what? He can leave it at home or whatever. So this one is for little Lincoln because it has trucks and he's obsessed with trucks. So I got him that one. This one I think I'm going to give to um, Phoenix. He's getting so much older now. And this is just the little helicopters. And then I got the trains for Baby River. Aren't they cute? I don't know if if Phoenix is going to like it, but you know what? He won't tell me. He'll just keep it in his room. He probably won't use it. Um, we're going to have the boys over the uh, Christmas vacation uh, overnight. So we want to have a movie night with them. So I just picked up this Act 2 butter flavored popcorn. So they love popcorn and so do we. Um, so I picked that up. I used to buy popcorn by like, you know, the case, I think you get like 15 or 20 packs. And then we don't do that anymore because my husband and I don't eat it that much. But when the boys come over, we like to have it. I picked up a couple of these. These are just the uh, wreath hangers. Uh, but that's not what I'm using them for. I've seen somebody do a project with them and use them as uh, little skis or li the bottom of, of something to make it look like a sleigh. So I picked two of those up to give that a try. I either picked two or three, I kind of forget. So when I was ever, whenever I was looking around on an end cap, I noticed that they, they're just rolling out the Valentine stuff now. So I, there was three different ones of these. This is the only one that I picked up. I think it's so adorable. So you can place your little notes in there or whatever. It's just so cute. So I picked that up. So it's rolling out now, guys, all the Valentine's things. So this is this 
Crazy Shimmer and Sparkle. And I picked this up because this makes a wonderful gift for someone. Uh, you know, with, with a child who's a little bit younger, it just says, color your own squeezy treats. And it looks like this. So for a dollar twenty-five, yes, please. I just think it's so cute and it tells you exactly how to do it. And I thought, you know what? That would be really fun for somebody to do. So I got that. I picked this up for my grandsons and I'm gonna again share it in their Christmas socks. And it's just the cherry yum. It's the fun dip and it's the cherry flavored one. So there's several packs in here and I think that they will love it. They like this stuff. So I got that for them. Picked up two of these little slinkies to put in their sock and their, their Christmas socks. Not that they don't have enough, but I just wanna make sure. So I picked up two of those. Oh, I picked up three boxes of the Bear Paws. So here's the other one. And this one is a spooky chocolate chip. So I got that for them as well. And I'll share that within all their socks. Um, oh yes. Oh, there's the other one that I picked up. I did pick up three of the wreath hangers. So I picked um, I picked Phoenix up some of these number books and it's just um, learning sticker books. It says pre-K, but you know what? He'll have fun doing this with his brother and adding it to their little room that they have, their study room or craft room, whatever you want to call it, that they have. It's so beautiful. So I picked up two of those for Phoenix, but I got each of the boys a little book for their um, Christmas sock. So this one is going to be for Lincoln. Jake travels back in time. I think that these are so cute. They really, really are. Look at this. Look how beautiful the pictures are inside just gorgeous so i got that one for lincoln but phoenix but phoenix and river have the same one because they're not in the same household so i got them both this one and this one is joey the super stocks hero and like phoenix is really really reading a lot so he will love to read this but look how beautiful these pictures are in here and that's why i picked them up i think that these are gorgeous just beautiful books i really really love them I think that they're beautiful. So I picked up three all together and then River will have one exactly like Phoenix's, but that's okay, they're not in the same house. I picked up some more Christmas bags just to be sure. You can never go wrong with Christmas bags. Store them away for next year if you don't use them. So I picked up five of these gorgeous and I think I might frame one of these. I think it's beautiful. This one says, let it snow. It's just my boyfriend. <laughs> it's just a picture of my boyfriend. Look at how cute that is. I'm in love with it, so I got five of those all together. And then I picked up two of these Merry Christmas bags with these adorable little Santa and the snowmen in there as well. Look at that, and it says Merry Christmas. Isn't that sweet? Love, love, love. And that's it for my haul, guys. But let me show you two little things that I've been working on. Um, for one of them, it, well, they're both for my neighbors for Christmas. And I made several of these to give out as Christmas gifts because I think that they're really, really nice and I love making them. And it's getting me used to using my Cricut. So I'm really proud of that as well. So this one I made for one of my neighbors. Just want to clean off the little sparkles. <laughs> so it just looks like this. It's just made on a round. And most times I stamp it, you know, uh, made with love, Gail, or made by Gail Patricia's Dollar Tree Halls and more, but it's going to my neighbors, so I won't. But it just says welcome. And I used this, there's little wording, little words in behind these little letters, like in it. So in the vinyl that I cut out, and I got that vinyl at the Dollar Tree, and it is wonderful to work with. So I made this one. And then this one is actually for my little neighbor next door. I say little, she's an elderly lady that we help all the time. She's a sweet, sweetheart. And I made this for her. I always make her a little gift basket as well. And I love how it turned out. So this one is just Christmas kind of, well, it is Christmas related with the beautiful little snowflakes that I printed out on my Cricut. And then I just printed out the welcome. And then these signs were just this brown. And then I just put some, um, stain on it and then I painted this portion and painted that and then I added this cute little bow and some greenery and I think it turned out really cute because and then I also added this little um snowflake here and it's clear I don't know if you can see it you know and I just put a little hook at the back for them but they turned out so cute I really really love how this one turned out so that is it for today guys I hope you guys have a great rest of your day and I will see you guys soon thanks so much for joining me bye everybody